Uh, hey dolls! Okay, oh my goodness. Okay, um, first off, I just want to say I'm so sorry if my voice is all cracky and stuff. I'm actually sick right now. Um, my mom thinks that it's laryngitis, but <clears throat> I have no idea. So, um, I'm going to put off videos until I get my voice back. Um, I'm going to film two videos today real quick for you guys just because um, I want to talk to you about this and I get a ton of questions asking me about these the kinds of things. So um, the first thing that I want to talk to you guys about is obviously my new phone. Um, you guys know I upgraded to the uh, the iPhone 5S. Excuse me. <clears throat> I'm still going to try and take this video in one take but I might have to stop and cough and stuff. So. Hopefully I can get this video up and everything. But, um, so yes, I do still have my iPhone 4. And now I have the iPhone 4S, or 5S, sorry, I'm my brain's everywhere. Um, I upgraded. Um, now, all you guys are going to ask, well, why did you upgrade? What's going to happen to all your cases? <coughs> uh, what are you going to do with everything? Um, and here's the deal. This phone did not have a plan on it. I never had a plan on this phone. I bought the phone used off of Craigslist for like um, 150 bucks or something like that. And um, I always just used it with Wi-Fi. Like if I was at home and stuff, I could call and text using the app TextMe. Um, <clears throat> and so that was my iPhone 4 that I used. And um, you guys know I have a ton of cases for that. Um, first off, I'm going to be... Um, keeping the iPhone 4 and all of its cases for now. Um, please don't ask me what I'm going to do with them in the future, if I'm going to do a giveaway, if I'm going to sell them, etc, etc. The reason I'm actually keeping them for a while is because a lot of them <clears throat> were either specially made for me or subscribers had sent them to me and I don't feel it's right to just give those away or to sell them and make money off of, you know, gifts. That's just kind of rude. So. <clears throat> I don't know if I'm going to end up just keeping them, just always keeping them, or if I might do a giveaway. I do want to um, personally address the people who have sent me cases. Um, I want to contact them each individually somehow, some way or another, probably via email or something, to find out if it's okay if I were to give the phone cases away that they had already sent me. Um, but I'm not just going to go and give them away. That's just beyond, beyond, completely and totally rude. Rebel, what are you doing? Rebel's shaking and stuff back there. But <clears throat> anyway, that would be totally rude if someone went out of their way to send me a press email and had tons of cases in it, just like the last one. Um, that would be completely and totally rude for me to just go, you know, get rid of all of them or just sell all of them, you know, or even just give them away. Um, those were like specially sent to me, so I don't want to be rude. Um, <clears throat> and the reason I got the iPhone 5S is because I finally can afford and I can finally, you know, support myself and stuff. So I can finally afford a phone plan. And so I went through Verizon and uh, my boyfriend and I had called around a little bit asking um, if they had any uh, 4S, 4S, um, iPhone 4S's. Because I've heard that the iPhone 4S has a little bit better camera and it's faster. It's like two times faster or something. So um, my iPhone 4, it's it's a 16 gigabyte. And I always kept getting like messages and notifications and stuff saying like, oh, you're low on memory, blah, 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 because I'm such a big picture person and I like to vlog a lot. I have a lot of photos and everything on my phone. So I'm constantly having to like delete some and everything. Um, and I wanted to possibly get a 4S, then that way I could keep all of my cases, my phone would be a little bit faster, but I wanted to get a 32 gig, um, so I wouldn't have to worry about memory or space nearly as much. And <clears throat> we called around and stuff, and it turns out that they don't make the iPhone 4S's anymore. The only ones that they do make are 8 gig, and I'm not about to do that. Now, I could have gotten a plan on this phone. But if I would have gotten a plan on this phone, then I can't really, you know, upgrade my phone later on um, because I didn't purchase the phone through Verizon. Um, so, and my phone is exceedingly slow and I'm always struggling with the memory and everything. So, I was really, really, really devastated to have to upgrade because I didn't want to have to upgrade at all. Um, but now that I actually have the iPhone 5S, I am glad that I upgraded just for the fact that 
um, not only can I start fresh with all my cases, but the, <coughs> excuse me, Rebel, quit rolling around back there. Mommy's filming. Thank you. Um, but the, uh, the camera quality is so much better, and I can totally, like, vlog more. I'll be more intrigued to vlog more, and I'll actually be able to make posts and everything when I'm out, you know, away from my house because I don't need Wi-Fi because I have my phone. Um, and this is a 32 gig and it is the silver one, in case you guys were wondering, I'll go ahead and pop the back of my case off real quick so you guys can see. It is the silver one, and it is a 32 gig, and it is the iPhone 5S. Um, I did not want to upgrade at all, you guys. I was so sad, too. I was like, no, I just reached getting 100 cases. Um, and as for my iPhone case collection that I had promised you guys for my iPhone 4, it will still be up. I'll still be doing the case collection. Um, but... And I'll also add on to it with my iPhone 5 cases. Um, so I'll do all the iPhone 4 cases, and at the end of it, I'll do the iPhone 5 cases, the start of them. But right now, I can kind of show you a couple. I have this one right here. It's Princess Luna. I got this at Hot Topic. And I also got this one right here that is the Kara Covers Rainbow Dash. Um, you guys know that on my iPhone 4, I had my the Fluttershy one. And I went there and I asked them if they had any any Fluttershy. And they said, no, they sell out like hotcakes so much. So hopefully I can find the Fluttershy one later on. Uh, but for now I just got the, um, the Rainbow Dash one because I needed at least one really protective case for my phone. And these are these are pretty protective. Um, I've, I've dropped these a few times um, when I had my uh, Fluttershy one on my iPhone 4 and it didn't break or paint didn't chip or anything. So it was really awesome. And then the, um, I'm actually working on making myself a deco case right now. Um, it's going to be like Rila Kuma and I'll post pictures on my Instagram so you can see it. And then I went to my local Dollar Tree and I actually just picked these two up. This one's just a hot neon pink. I figure I could just either wear it like this or cover it with stickers or something. And, um, then I got this one right here. It's really cool. It's like one of those changing ones. And again, I got this at my local Dollar Tree, so it's like really cool. But it's just zebra, and it changes from the pattern to the zebra head. And I think that one's really cute, too. So those are my current iPhone 5S cases and everything. And, <clears throat> again, I'm sorry about my voice. I just, I'm filming on my iPad right now, so I don't want to resume, like, video videos until, you know, I have the energy to sit down, set up my lighting, set everything up. But right now I'm just filming on my iPad. I figure, you know, it's high enough quality that all I'm doing is talking to you guys. I'm not really showing you a lot of stuff, so it's not that big of a deal. Oh, and this phone case is, if, if you wanted to know where this phone case was from, it's from LuxAddiction.com. I had previously already done a review on this case, so if you want to see that, go ahead and head on over um, to my product reviews play playlist, and it'll be in that playlist. Um, but it's just a Lux Addiction case. And you guys are probably thinking, oh, you just got that beautiful case. What are you going to do? Um, I actually contacted the company, and I explained to them my situation and everything. What they had originally told me was that <clears throat> if my review video got 2,000 views or more, that they would host a giveaway on my channel. Um, and so, surprise for you guys, my video has reached over 2,000 views, and you guys are going to get a Lux Addiction giveaway. But the only thing that I'm going to do is... Um, because I upgraded to the 5S, um, I, I'll explain this later on in the giveaway video, but because I upgraded to the 5S like a few days after I got this case and I'm not really able to use this case, this is going to be the case that I'm going to be giving away and then I'm going to be getting a new one from Lux Addiction for my new phone. Um, so you guys will have the chance to win this iPhone 4 4S case. Um, I know it's sad that, you know, not everyone can enter because not everyone has an iPhone 4. Um, but no fret, because I will be doing a giveaway probably either at the beginning or the mid-February. Um, it will be a phone case giveaway of some sort, and you guys will be able to win a, ca win a case of some sort for your device. Um, whatever device you may have. Uh, but the Lux Addiction case is only going to be open for um, everyone who has an iPhone 4 or 4S. So, and don't worry, I know I'm sick and I'm like touching this phone and I'm like breathing on it and everything. Um, I will definitely wipe this case down with alcohol wipes and completely and totally sanitize it before I ship it out to you. A hundred million percent because that's just gross and that's just mean to just like, eh, eh, you know, cough all over it and then send it to you guys like, here, have my germs. It's like, woo, yay, I got sick. What'd you win for Amanda's giveaway? A cold? No, um, <laughs> 
but um, I will I will have this all cleaned up and totally sanitized and everything so you won't have to worry about that um, and if you know if you're freaked out still about getting the germs and everything you don't have to enter so uh, with that being said, I'm probably going to go ahead and wrap this up. I'm going to be doing another video right after this one talking about my P.O. Box. Um, I get a lot of questions of people asking me where to send the fan mail and the letters and the Prezi mail and everything. And you guys are just too sweet. So I actually went out and I finally got a P.O. Box today. And that's what my next video is going to be about. So I will talk to you soon. So until then, so long, stay strong, stay true, and be you. Okay, bye! And sorry for my voice.